Hi, West Street families. This is Mrs. Wilson. I'm just reaching out with a really quick hello. I wanted to let you know I'm thinking about you and that I miss you. I miss your smiles, your laughter, your silliness, and I mostly miss your hugs. We can't be together right now, but we want you to know that we're really thinking about you. And more than that, families, moms, dads, aunts, uncles, grandmas, grandpas, caregivers, foster parents, everyone, we want to thank you. We know that you didn't expect this. You didn't sign up for this. We're their teachers, and now you are again. Although you've always been their first teacher, now they're relying on you for so much more. And we want to thank you. I want you to know it's okay if you don't have the best days and you don't get all the work done that day. Try again tomorrow. That's what I tell my own children. Like you, you might be spending some time outside. I'm in my backyard right now because I just had to get away from the table. And that's okay too. Many times I tell your children at school, I keep them safe so they can get smart. Now that's up to you. And I don't take that lightly. It's a big responsibility and you are giving it everything you have. Please, we know you're stressed out. We're stressed out too. We really miss your kids. There's nothing like a school without having the kids in it. I want you to know that not only I am thinking about you, my entire staff is. In a minute you're going to get to see what I mean. Please reach out any way you can. I'm an email or a phone call away. Know that I thank you for your work. I can't wait to see you and I love you. Be safe. Be well. You are missed. This is Mrs. Santiago. I just want to say thank you for your partnerships we've created this year. Thank you for continuing to straighten this partnership during these unprecedented times. We can all agree that we are faced with many challenges due to COVID. We are now faced with fear, stress, and uncertainty as we juggle a new way of life with our homes, jobs, families, and trying to keep healthy. I'm so proud that through all of these challenges, we've continued to maintain focus on your child's education. I'm so thankful for the growing bonds during this time, the outreach of questions, and for you welcoming me into your home during video conferencing with your child. You may not realize, and I wanna let you know that you're all doing an amazing job with the educational resources I've provided faced with the many new challenges in our daily lives. I'm so grateful for our West Street family. Keep up the late night and early morning messages for help. I'm here to continue to support you and your children no matter what you may need. Keep up the great work. Stay healthy. We love you. Hello and hola to West Street parents. I want to take this time to send you a big hug and a special thank you for all you are doing to support our children and us teachers. It is not an easy time, and but remember that West Street teachers and staff are here to support you. All I want for you, all of you is to remember to enjoy your family, stay safe, and take one day at a time. Reach out to us whenever you need us. Health and happiness. I love you, Mrs. Jositis. Hi, this is Mrs. Ethia from West Street School. To all the parents and to all the Southbridge community, I just wanted to reach out to you and I hope that everyone is healthy at this time during these trying and difficult times. You guys are doing an amazing job with your with your children at home. And lastly, I just wanted to say that um, every child that believes in himself starts with a parent that has believed in him first. You take care of yourselves, be safe, and I can't wait to see the students again. Hello, this is Mrs. Tatro. I hope all that you are doing well, and I know it's been hard to balance the work, the home life, and now the role as teacher. I know it can be overwhelming at times, and I totally understand that, but please remember that we're all in this together and we're experiencing it together. Know that you are doing a great job. Continue to love them, hug them, listen to them, and support them. Thank you for doing that tremendous work and helping your children with the learning packets, the online resources, and just thinking of other ways to incorporate learning into their lives, like cooking together, planting seeds to make a garden, doing an art project together. Thank you for sharing those wonderful pictures with me and videos. I love to see the children and all the work that they've done. I want you to know that I'm here for you. 
and I appreciate all the work that you've done. Hola, soy la señora Luna, y hoy quiero decir gracias a todos los padres de nuestra comunidad. Gracias por ser paciente con los maestros y maestras de Southbridge. Gracias por hacer el esfuerzo y ayudar a sus hijos con las tareas académicas. Sé que no es fácil, pero juntos saldremos de esa situación y podremos vernos otra vez. Apreciamos todo lo que ustedes hacen por los niños. Recuerden que cada pequeña ayuda es un paso para salir adelante. Hola, soy la señora Rivera. Hoy quiero aprovechar esta oportunidad para dirigirme a ustedes, padres, y decirle gracias. Gracias por asumir el rol de maestro para ayudar a sus hijos en un momento tan difícil como este. Gracias por mantener el compromiso con sus hijos, especialmente para aquellos que deben enseñar un segundo idioma, aún sin conocerlo por completo. Gracias porque más allá de cuidar su estabilidad académica, cuida su estabilidad emocional. Gracias por permanecer seguros en casa y aquellas personas que tienen que salir a trabajar diariamente. Mis respetos, ustedes son nuestros héroes. Juntos venceremos esta situación y volveremos a vernos pronto. Recuerden que apreciamos su esfuerzo, los que así que no se rindan. Hi parents and families, it's Mr. Hill. I just wanted to thank you and tell you how very proud the teachers of Southbridge are of all of you. No one is working harder than you to continue the education of Southbridge Southbridge's children. We love you, we see you, we know how important you are. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Saludos familia de West Street. Quiero aprovechar este momento para darle las gracias por todo lo que están haciendo. Ustedes son la razón del éxito de nuestros estudiantes. Reciban un fuerte abrazo de parte de la señora Vargas. Hi, families of West Street. I'm Ms. and I teach third grade dual language, the English side. I just wanted to take a minute to thank all of you for all that you're doing at home. You already were in charge of taking care of their learning and life, and now you are taking over the academic side as well. So we recognize how much extra work that is for you, and we are so proud of all the work that you're doing at home, and we miss all of you so much. Dear wonderful families, I know not every day is easy. I know and understand how challenging things can get and how completely overwhelming things can be. We're all here for you. We love and appreciate you and all you're doing. You are truly amazing. Please hug your beautiful children for me. Hello, everybody, my wonderful students and family members. I miss you all so much. I miss seeing your smiling faces and hugging you and hearing your funny stories every day. My life's not the same without you. One thing I've learned from my time at home is how lucky Lucky I am to have such an amazing, strong, and brave, loving students and family supporting me. I'm so happy that I've had the opportunity to get to know some of my families better during this time. And I'm so appreciative for all the support that you've given, not only to your children, but to me as well. Um, it's not our nature as teachers to be away from our students. So um, they say it takes a village to raise a child. And boy, is that becoming so evident and true to all of us. You're doing an absolutely amazing job, whatever you're doing. It seems we may have lost Miss McDowell because of the internet. That's Ms. okay. Elsie? Hello, 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 friends. I just want you guys to, re to, to remind you guys to always believe in yourself, to be confident and work hard to get your dream, be good human to help people, and just remember that Miss Elsie loves you a lot. And you, all of you guys are my princes and princesses. Hello, kiddos and families of Westry. It's Mrs. Henry. And I wanted to tell you, I miss you so much every single day. I also want to let you know that I am so, so proud of all the work that you've been doing at home. You've been doing paper packets in Google Classroom. You've been cooking and cleaning. I've seen gardening and science experiments, helping with brothers and sisters at home. All of this is so, so amazing. And I'm so proud to be your teacher. 
Families, I want you to know, um, I thank you very much for stepping into a new role during this time um, for everything that you do for all of our kids. Keep up all the reading, all the awesome work, stay curious, and don't forget to come join us for a Google Hangout. I hope to see you soon, Wildcats. Hi, families. Thank you for welcoming into your homes with all of our Google classes, and thank you for all the replies to my many emails. I know this isn't an easy process, but I want you to know that you are all doing a fantastic job of helping your children learn from home. Remember, we are all doing our part in this together. Hi, families. I know this is a really un unknown and scary time for all of us, but you're doing great. Everyone is doing everything that they can possible right now. This isn't something that you signed up to do, but it's something that you're doing really, really well. And I'm sure your kids appreciate it and we appreciate it. And we're really hoping that we'll all see you again in the fall when all of this is over. Hi, families. I just wanted to thank you for everything that you're doing with your child's learning. And I hope that you are staying happy and healthy and safe. Good morning, families. I just wanted to say thank you for all your hard work and we miss you and we love you and you're doing a great job. Hello, everybody. I just want to let you all know that I miss you so very much. I think that the way you and your families are handling all this transition is amazing. And I can't tell you how proud, proud I am of all of you. Um, miss you and can't wait to see you in the fall. Hi, everyone. Um, to all of our students, we just want you to know that we really miss you every single day we miss seeing your faces i miss greeting you all in the morning um to all our parents caregivers grandparents all of you out there i know this is hard you are doing a fantastic and wonderful job we are all overwhelmed this is hard for all of us but you're just doing a really really great job thank you everybody for everything from the bottom of my heart and from one parent to another, you're doing a great job. You and your students' personal best may vary day to day, and that's okay. One day you're going to slay that packet and you're going to get all your Google Classroom stuff done, and the next day you're in survival mode. Please be gentle with yourself. It's okay. We're all going through the same thing. You're not alone. Your student has everything they need being home safe with you. Did you teach them a new recipe? Bam, math, reading, science, right there. You're doing a great job and we're here for you. Please reach out if you need anything. We love you. Hi families. I know school looks a lot different right now, but that's okay. I hope you're being patient, trying your best, and most importantly, being kind. We cannot wait to see you all. Hi, West Street families. This is Mrs. Keen. And I just wanna say thank you, thank you, thank you. Parents and guardians, I am so amazed with your patience and your kindness. I know no one could have planned for this, but you have done an outstanding job. And kids, I miss you so much. And I know you miss seeing your friends every day. Um, and I've got three things for you to remember. One, thank your parents every day for everything they're doing. They really are superheroes. Number two. Take a few quiet minutes each day to appreciate nature. The world outside is changing right now, and don't miss it. Number three, learn something new each day. Because the beautiful thing about learning is that no one can take it away from you. Keep up the great work, and I'll see you soon. Hi, it's Mrs. Briggs. I want to thank you to our new fantastic frontline teachers, your parents. Welcome to the West Street Wildcat team of amazing teachers. Now your parents get to be the teachers. Parents and families and guardians, you are appreciated. You are respected. You are rock stars. Thank you for always responding and reaching out. You have raised amazing kids. And we know because we miss them every day. Thank you. Until next time. Hi, it's Mrs. Reno. Um, hi to West Street students and families. I hope you're all well, and I miss seeing all of you. The future depends upon the quality education our students receive. And parents, you're doing a great job teaching your children until we can meet again. And students, you're also doing a great job learning at home. Please keep up working hard and keep moving forward. We'll soon be together again, and I love you all.
Hi, West Street families. I want you to know how sad I am about not being back in school, but I do know that it's the responsible and safe thing to do. And I just miss I you, want all you to so know much. that we all understand how hard it is learning at home, but you are all doing such an incredible job. You're all trying so hard, and I'm too. I am blown away with how amazing you all are, and I am blessed to be a part of this incredible community. I love and miss you all so much. Stay safe, happy, and healthy. Hello, West Street families and students. I miss your children so much, parents. And you are doing a wonderful job with everything you do. Gracias por todo lo que haces. Eres maravilloso. You've raised wonderful children, as the other teachers said. We miss them. We love them. Hi, West Street families. I found, as I thought about what a wonderful job you're doing and your students are doing, I found a little poem about school and how they go together. So I'd like to read that to you. It's called Unity by Cleo Swarat. And it goes like this, and I'm gonna cry because I miss you all so much. I dreamt I stood in a studio and watched two sculptors there. The clay they used was a young child's mind and they fashioned it with care. One was a teacher. The tools he used were books and music and art. One was a parent with a guiding hand and a gentle, loving heart. Day after day, the teacher toiled with a touch that was deft and sure, with the parent laboring by his side, and he polished and smoothed, smoothed it over. And when at last their work was done, they were proud of what they had wrought for the things they had molded into the child could neither be sold nor bought. And each agreed they would have failed if each had worked alone. For behind the teachers, the school, for behind the parents of the school, and behind the teacher, the home. Thank you all for the love, for the hard work. Miss you all. Hi, West Street families. Thank you so, so much. Raising children is so hard. A lot of us are parents. We understand that. And you're being asked to do so much more right now. You are exactly what your kids need. You're providing stability, your academics, and you're providing love. And we're here to support you in every way. We miss you and we can't wait to see you again. Lots of love from Mrs. Sergil. Thank you, families. In the words of former first lady, the first, um, the home is the child's first school. The parent is the child's first teacher. And reading is the child's first subject. Keep reading. Your impact on your child at home during this difficult time is immeasurable. Thank you for being a great parent and a wonderful teacher every day. I am thinking of you and sending you lots of love to all of you and your families, stay safe. We miss our fifth graders a great deal. We think about you guys every day for our parents out there in our West Street School family. We think you're incredible. You're doing a fantastic job. I have the immense amount of respect for you and everything you do and taking care of your children. Um, but you kiddos, I know you're working hard every day I'm proud of you, all of you, and keep up the good work. I want you to make a promise to yourself. Keep trying to learn something new every single day. Please be safe and healthy. Keep smiling, Wildcats. A child's first teacher is the parent. You guys are doing wonderful. I know it's challenging for everybody during this time, us teachers included, but don't give up. You know, we're proud of you parents and we're proud of our students. We miss our fifth graders and stay safe and healthy. West Street parents, you're amazing. We miss your kids. We miss you. We miss the interaction. This isn't easy for anyone on any level. We've been thrown a huge curveball in your child's education. And you have done such amazing things to move their learning forward. Thank you so much for making a difference. We love you. We love your students. Stay safe, and we hope to see you soon. 
Hi, West Street families. We would like to thank you for all the hard work that you are putting in to support our students. We appreciate you. We are here to help you. We want you to know that you are doing a great job. You're doing a great job at home with our students. Keep it up. Stay safe, stay strong, and be well. Good morning, West Street School. I'm Mrs. Langto, grade five teacher. And I miss all our hugs in the morning and our silliness during the day. But I hope that you take seriously your studies, but not too seriously. Have some fun, play with your dogs, play with your sisters and brothers, but most of all, be safe. I miss you and I hope to see you pretty soon. Hi, West Street parents. It's Mrs. Ayotte here. And I just wanted to let you know that I'm also home with my four children, trying to educate them and get their schoolwork done. And I know it's hard, but every day we get up and we do it. And I wanna thank you for doing that because you're making such an impact on your children. And we love them so much and we miss them so much. And we cannot wait to get back to what we're doing. We love you all. We miss you. Be safe and take care. Hi, I'm Miss Bailey, speech and language. I was just getting to know you and then suddenly school stopped. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Oh, wait, I missed something. Oh, it's you. I miss you lots, like tater tots. Please have fun and stay safe till we meet again at West Street Elementary. Hi, West Street families. Uh, this is Kathy Schofield. I'm the literacy coach at West Street School. And I just want to take a minute to say thank you for all the hard work you're doing at home with your children. I'm a parent too, so I know how challenging it can be but know that you're doing a great job. We appreciate you. Keep reading and we hope to see you soon. Thank you. Hi, West Street families. Um, I'm Ms. Schultz. I'm a school adjustment counselor at West Street and I am so grateful for all you are doing to juggle. And you have to juggle health and I can't juggle either. So it's gonna go plop and you're gonna have to juggle your work and education. And then also you have to have some playtime and don't forget about the playtime and thank you for doing all you do. And remember, even if you drop a few of those balls, you can still laugh and laughter is the best medicine. Good morning, West Street parents. It's Mrs. Pratt, Library and Technology. I just wanna thank you for all you've been doing in this unprecedented time. We know it's affected all of us differently and we appreciate you picking up the pieces. We love having you on our West Street team. Just remember, take it one day at a time, set yourself a schedule, that works for you. We miss you all. Remember, we're all in this together. West Street friends, Mr. Klein, PE, just wanted to say, I hope you're all healthy and doing well, and we will see you soon. We miss you. Hello, West Street Wildcat families. This is Mrs. Goodnow. I'm the music teacher. All I'd like to say to you is, thank you for all that you do. You make us feel so special and very lucky. We're glad that you are here. We couldn't do this without you, that's the truth. And so we say that we appreciate you. Yes, we really, 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 really do. Thank you. Thank you so much for all you're doing and thanks for your support. Take care and stay safe. Hello, West Street School parents. This is Ms. Ortiz. For those of you who don't know me, I'm the one that calls once in a while to check on you to see how things are going. And uh, I am very grateful that you pick up the phone when I call. So if I were to call you today, I would call you to tell you doing an awesome job. We really appreciate what you're doing, working with all of us. Now I'm going to say this in Spanish real quickly. Buenos días a todos. Gracias por contestar el teléfono cuando yo llamo. Gracias por trabajar tan duro con sus hijos. Los esperamos de nuevo en la escuela. Los extrañamos mucho y esperamos verlos pronto. Hasta luego. Hi, West Street families. Miss Talis here. I have a little list that I want to read you. Number one, I miss you. Number two, read books. Number three, 
Take the time to say or do something nice for the family that you're living with right now. Every single member. Number four, play outside or go for a walk. Number five, play some games. And lastly, I love you guys. Hi, West Street family and friends. My name is Miss W and I am an EA at West Street. And I just wanted to say, I am so proud of all the families and kids getting together, doing everything that they possibly can through this tough time. I'm a parent too, so I understand how hard it can be. All you can do is keep doing what you're doing. It's working. Thank you, everybody. I miss all of you. Some of you are struggling to balance work, childcare, and helping your kids do school at home. Others love your children more than life itself, but are finding 24 hours a day, every day, week after week, month after month. Well, let's just say that can be trying at times. Let me say, it is okay to get frustrated, be angry, sad, mad, or to feel alone in a crowd or like you have lost your last good nerve. You are not alone. Many of us feel these things at one time or another, especially in these difficult times. I can only recommend that you find a bit of time for yourself, no matter how small, to recharge, recoup, or gather yourself. If you are struggling, find someone to talk to, whether friend, neighbor, one of our adjustment counselors, or even seeking professional counseling, whether it be online or via telephone if needed. Sometimes a person needs a safe place to vent. I will admit in these current times, I feel helpless in how to help our students and families, but I am trusting that you, the guardians of my students, ensure that they feel loved and secure, and that if you can, you will say good morning to them every morning. Even if it's not a great morning for you, they need to hear it, so hopefully it'll be a good day for them. Say good night to them every night if you can. But more than that, provide them with the opportunities to be good, then catch them doing good, and praise it. It is a struggle to get them to learn when video games and entertainment are a click away, but learn they must. For knowledge is power, and education is the key that unlocks that knowledge. For all that you have done and are doing, thank you. And until I can greet your students in the morning again, please remind them that there is an entire building that cares about them, and they are not alone, nor are you. Take care and stay safe. This is Ms. Matthew, your secretary at the school. I would like to say thank you to the parents and for the children to continue doing your best. I just have a little something that I want to read. How does one thank you for all the things you do? In the dictionary under generosity should be a photo of you. How does one thank you for all the things you do? I do not know what we would have done had it not been for you. How do we express our feelings for the things you did for us, never expecting gratitude or praise and never wanting a fuss? All I can do is say thank you and hope that the meaning is clear, that it is a deep heartfelt thanks and pray that it's depth your heart can hear. Hi everyone, this is Nurse Clements. Um, I just want to say that I'm proud of all of our West Street families for pushing through these hard times um, and focusing on the health and safety of our community. Um, you are all so incredibly strong. Hi, West Street families. This is Maria Murray, your assistant principal. I just wanted to say thank you to all the parents, grandparents, and guardians out there. You are amazing people. You've stepped up during this challenging time and gone the extra mile for our students. I know this is a difficult time and we're faced with many daily challenges and disappointments, but I want you to know we're all in this together and we will come out of it even stronger as people, as a district, as a community. Remember, when you step up, amazing things can happen and the universe responds by moving mountains and pebbles alike. Thank you for being so brave and believing in your children and in us, and most of all, in believing in yourself. You got this. Thank you, everybody. We hope to see you soon. We miss you and we love you. Be safe.